Tonight, in a Fox 23 exclusive body cam video of local police pepper spraying an 84 year old woman. Turn her ass face that way now. Or I'll spray you. You see it there, you, right there. You may remember we talked with a woman last week. She says Muskogee officers looking for her son wrongfully attacked her. Fox 23's Eddie Randall is live with reaction from the police department and more of that video. Eddie. Shay and Clay, we've stayed in touch with Muskogee police since we first interviewed Geneva Smith last week. And although it took some time, police did release this statement and they also gave us this body camera video. An 84-year-old woman pepper sprayed by a Muskogee police officer is what has many people around town talking. Police say this all started while they searched for the woman's son. Police say he ran a stop sign, then refused to stop, then darted into this home. Police say they asked the man to come out, but he refused. So they went in. You can hear police yell for the man to come towards them before they tase him. Come here. I'm going to tase you. Do it now. Then out comes his 84-year-old mother, Geneva Smith, who police command to turn around. Stay there, ma'am. We counted, and about 40 seconds after the command, they pepper sprayed her, and then she goes down. We talked to her last week, and on Friday, we reviewed the video with the assistant city attorney and sat down with the chief of police, Rex Eskridge, who says the department is working to resolve the situation. This is a very important issue. Uh, uh, there's a lot of misinformation out there. There's a lot of prejudgment going on. There's a lot of concern. For that reason, he tells me they released the video to be transparent by building on the positive relationship he says police have with the community. Do you believe the videos show everything? Videos can't give you the full sense of what happened, but at the same time, they do uh, either validate or um, expose any warts that you might have. Police say they still have two officers to interview before they can complete that internal investigation. The chief of police will decide what to do from there. Reporting live this evening in Muskogee, covering news that matters, I'm Eddie Randall, Fox 23 News.